Welcome to Catalina Treats Gluten-Free Bakery. I'm Jessie and we're making chocolate crackles. Chocolate crackles is an Australian treat and I have a special guest all the way from Australia. Sadia from the Recipes with Little East channel is here. Sadia and I worked on a video for her channel and I asked her if she'd help me to make chocolate crackles. Sadia, tell us about yourself and your channel. Thanks for having me. I'm a mum of a one-year-old and I started my channel to share some of our favourite things to eat. You'll find lots of simple, delicious and healthy recipe ideas, as well as a few cheeky desserts. Tell us about chocolate crackles. I grew up eating chocolate crackles at birthday parties or at school bake stalls. They were always really popular. They're sweet, chocolatey, a little bit crunchy and super delicious. I've heard about chocolate crackle every now and then. I love the Australian show Rosehaven. On one of the episodes, Emma makes chocolate crackles for a real estate open house. And after I saw that, I really wanted to try making them. So let's get started. We'll make chocolate crackles in two different ways. The first requires a large mixing bowl and a microwave. Start with four cups of puffed rice, one cup of powdered sugar, one cup of desiccated coconut flakes, and three tablespoons of cocoa powder. Mix these ingredients together and then add in one cup of coconut oil. Stir this mixture until all the ingredients are well combined. Then you need to scoop the mixture into the muffined cups and you can pat it down a little bit. This makes nice individual servings. Pop the pan into the refrigerator and let the chocolate crackles set up. You need to wait about 15 minutes and then the crackles are ready to serve. To make these chocolate crackles gluten-free, I'm not gonna be using Rice Krispies. I'll be using puffed rice. Rice Krispies are made with a rice paste and malt. Malt has gluten. Puffed rice is just rice, and it gives these chocolate crackles a completely different texture than Rice Krispies. The other way to make chocolate crackles is stovetop in a large stock pot. Melt one cup of coconut oil over low heat. When the oil is melted, add in one cup of powdered sugar, three tablespoons of cocoa powder, and a pinch of sea salt. Stir this mixture together until everything is well combined and smooth. This takes a couple of minutes. Add in one cup of desiccated coconut flakes and stir again. When the coconut is blended, you can add in four cups of puffed rice and mix until the rice is well coated. Scoop the crackles into muffin cups and pat them down a little bit. Get the muffin tin into the refrigerator until the chocolate crackles are cooled. You can also fill a casserole dish and pat the mixture down and put that into the refrigerator. Both of these recipes have exactly the same ingredients, but the methods make them very different. Leave us a comment, let us know if you try them both and which is your favorite. I'm so grateful for Sadia joining me and to help me finally make these great treats. Please check out her channel, Recipes for Littlies. I will leave a link for her channel in the comments below. Sadia has some great videos. We hope you love these chocolate crackles. Please like our video, subscribe to our channel, and share this with your friends and family. We're always creating great new recipes at Catalina Treats Gluten-Free Bakery.